to see a new face around here. Hey, friend. The actor's just through that door and down the stairs. Keep your wits about you. scared the life out of me. No one else wandering around down here. Uh, you're not from around here, are you? Name's Ace. Ace Cotterill? You? Is that right? Well, you found it. Starting that relic could mean trouble, though. So, you ever start a reactor? Well, it makes a lot of noise, for starters. Lucky for you, it's just the press of a button on the terminal above us. Would have done it myself, but without knowing what might come sniffing around. With the two of us, though, you know, maybe we got a chance. Okay, so I have an idea. You go upstairs and start the reactor. I'll help you kill whatever comes our way. You probably need a weapon, huh? Let's see if I can find you something. and start the reactor. Hey, you gonna start the reactor or what? Get up there and start the reactor. and the power's back on, I'd call that a win. You best go check in with Ford. Come visit my shop sometime, yeah? I'll make sure to give you the need some help out there discount.
been a while since I was in a fight like that. It's good to have some light around here. You're risking a lot for folks you don't know, stranger. Ah, uh, yes. You're trying to get yourself to that little island, yeah? Word moves fast, when there ain't many words left around here. Listen, friend, uh, I know you don't know me from a can of paint, but... I want to help. You, uh, you got a feeling of destiny about. That's the spirit. Uh, here. I want you to have this. Not many people can keep the spirits out there in the world. An old friend told me this little bobble could keep you for death at bay. At least for a while. And if you're looking to buy other treasures for your travels, come see me. Ace has got her own space over there. <laughs> Between us, we got all sorts of treasures. But that stone there, free of charge. Oh, one more thing. Ellen, uh, Commander Ford, she knows more about that island than she lets on. Uh, ask her about the founder of War 13. She'll get you on your path. <laughs> Good to see a new face around here. Glad to see you got the reactor running. <laughs> and I see Reggie gave you the dragon heart. <sighs> he wouldn't part with an artifact that powerful without... I suppose his notes would be useful to you. <laughs> Very well. Reggie may play the old fool, but his judgment is rarely off the mark. You've proven yourself reliable, stranger. I'm willing to help you get- but I doubt you'll last long out there without help. Go see Riggs and McCabe downstairs. They'll fit you with better gear. Come see me afterwards. Hey, it's good to see you on your feet again. Uh, welcome to Ward. I did what I could to patch you up. You seem like a tough one, though. <laughs> Name's Riggler. <laughs> but most everyone calls me Riggs. Well, your, uh, sword mm. was pretty banged up in the fight. Mm, not much I could do with it, I'm afraid. The blade was shattered when we found you. Mostly scrap metal at this point. Ford mentioned we should help you get sorted for the city, as a thanks for getting us out of a bind. Ah, maybe we can put your old blade to good use after all. Ah. Let me look. All right, hey, now that's better. Oh, and, uh, Take this. It's not the strongest stuff, but more protection than what you've got. Ah, there you go. A bit sturdier. Every little bit counts out there. It's true. We don't have much, but you did right by us. Best we do right by you. If you need any weapon upgrades in the future, come see me. McCabe over there will help you out with the augments for your gear. But, uh, 
Stick to business talk. You know, she's not much for chat beyond her work. So you're the stray Ford was talking about. <sighs> Said we should get you equipped for the city. Doesn't make sense to me, giving away good parts for nothing. Apparently taking out a few root is enough for our commander, though. Ford's gonna give my time to every stray who wanders in. And we're having words. I'm McCabe. I'm the engineer. And you're a pain in my ass. I'm not some scrap peddler, got it? I don't- All right, then. Let's see what we're dealing with here. This'll help keep you on your feet. Along with anyone else fool enough to join you. That's all you get for now. Get me more components and I'll make more. For a fee. Now get out of here. I'm tired of your yapping jaw. Yeah, yeah. Good to see you more equipped. Riggs and McCabe do good work. I hope this will be enough to get you on your way. We can't leave by the gates now, but the founder, my grandfather, gave me this key years ago. He said we should only use it when there's no other choice. Well, we are out of choices. Considering you stuck your neck out for us, it seems fitting you do the honors. Take it. There's a terminal downstairs in the main room. Use the key there. With any luck, we can get the thing running. Oh. Uh, don't thank me just yet. about it but I never saw it working this red eye might be our only door to the outside world now you want to get out of here this is your shot my grandfather was the commander before me they called him the founder of ward he brought everyone to ward 13 when the route first attacked he was determined to learn where the root came from. He spent so much time out there, searching, and one day... There's a room just outside the ward. All his notes, any hint of where he went, it's there. If you want to reach the atoll, he may be the last one who knew how to get there. Listen, I know this has all been a bit rough for you been rough for everyone. But you came through for us. For that, I'm grateful. You're welcome back anytime. Good luck. 